Good morning, you guys. So I decided I wanted to vlog today, but I also wanted to share with you guys kind of what I've been eating in a day. I've gotten to the point where I want to do something about my postpartum body. I am not happy with it. Miles is four months old. I figured it was time to get started. I've been incorporating very light exercising and going for walks whenever I can, but mainly I've been changing up my diet quite a bit. I was eating way too much and too much junk is the main issue. I know I'm supposed to take in some extra calories because I'm breastfeeding but I was taking in bad extra calories like I was eating snack cakes and things like that just stuff that wasn't even benefiting me so I figured I would show you guys what I'm eating that's a little bit healthier in case you guys needed some ideas as well I've been eating way less snacks and when I do snack it's actually snacks that are healthy and have some nutritional value to them I just finished making breakfast so I wanted to show that to you guys really quick before I eat it my go-to has been either eggs or oatmeal for breakfast so I'm just having some scrambled eggs with spinach and and cheese and then I'm having some blueberries and bananas those have also been my go-to fruits I do like a lot of different fruits but I feel like blueberries and bananas are my favorite so you will see me eating those a lot but yeah that's what I'm having for breakfast this morning I have already had my coffee and I'm not going to take coffee away from myself I never have I also wanted to say I do use the my fitness pal app to kind of keep track of my calories and I know a lot of people have different opinions on counting calories but I've just always use my fitness pal whenever I'm trying to lose a bit a little little bit of weight or lose like postpartum weight of course I am allowing myself a little bit of extra calories because I am still breastfeeding I don't want to like negatively affect my supply or anything like that but that's just what I'm doing so I'm gonna go ahead and eat breakfast really quick because I'm kind of letting it get cold and the boys are chilling perfect time for me to eat I am going to still be just vlogging it's gonna be a day in the life but I'm gonna be showing you guys what I eat throughout the day as well so we got Liam's first ever school pictures in, and I'm gonna show you guys. Of course, we got digital images, so we've already seen them and everything, but look at this. Look at how stinking cute my little kindergartner is. Can y'all believe that he is old enough to be in school and to be getting school pictures? How cute. I'm so excited. I cannot wait to frame it. I'm gonna have school pictures. I wanna have like a wall you know, once we have a bigger house and we have the room for it, I need just a wall of school pictures. Is that extra? That's probably a little bit extra, but I'm just, I can't look at it one more time. Just look at it one more time. Whoop, so cute. Thank you so much to Bellway for sponsoring today's video. They sent over three of their products for me to try out and share with you guys. So they sent over their super fiber plus fruit as well as their super fiber with plant protein and their super fiber plus collagen. Like I said, I've been on a huge health kick lately, so I'm really excited to try all of their products, but today I'm going to taste test their super fiber plus collagen. I got it in the strawberry lemonade flavor. Okay, so since I'm trying out the super fiber with collagen today, I wanted to tell you guys a little bit about it. So it says that this powder is made with psyllium husk probiotic, as well as collagen and hyaluronic acid, which is really, really good for your skin. It's also made with real fruit, and I'm really excited about the strawberry lemonade flavor. Let's just take a look at the back here. So it says psyllium fiber helps support a happy gut, less bloating, which I need. I've been drinking so much more water lately, all of the sudden that uh, it's making me bloat. So we shall see if this helps me. Feeling fuller, need. Stronger hair and nails, need. Youthful appearance, need, because your girl's 29. And skin elasticity. I wish that I was using this when I was pregnant, but still need. I was so excited when they reached out to me because I had actually just watched a video of Home with Haley's and she was showing this. She just showed this and I kid you not, like two days later, I got an email from them. But when she was talking about it, I wanted to order it because she was talking about how much it was helping her bloating. It was helping her feel full. And she even said that it was helping with her dry skin, which I have been talking about my dry skin the past like two months, I think. Absolutely nothing has helped it. I've been drinking a ton of water. I have tried all the creams. I have exfoliated my face. I have done all the things. Nothing has helped it. So we're gonna put this to the test. We're gonna see if it helps.
hold on. Okay, I expected that to taste a little bit weird because usually things like this do, but it just tastes like strawberry lemonade. That's crazy. It's actually really good, which I was worried about because I didn't tell you guys, it actually has zero grams of sugar. So there's no sugar added to this, but I like it. I'm gonna keep you guys updated, but I do have high hopes for this. Like I said, I know other people that have been using it and they have seen great results from it. I do plan on trying the others as well. I'm really, really excited about trying the protein one because I showed you guys in a vlog recently, I think. I bought some random like protein shakes from Walmart and they're not bad, but I did wanna start drinking protein shakes and try, just trying to get more protein in general and I've heard that chocolate one that they sent me is really really good so yeah tastes really good highly recommend so far it's just my first impression of it if you guys are interested in trying out Bellway for yourself I will have their link and everything down below as well as a discount code for you guys thank you again Bellway for sponsoring today's video happy mail is here I'm so excited but I wanted to point out for some reason whenever I get packages they always sit them on this chair I don't really know why but anyways I'm so excited about this. Okay, so this is Miles's Halloween costume. I told you guys recently that we had gotten the other boys' costumes. He's waking up, but we didn't have Miles's yet. So I ordered one off Amazon and I hope it fits him. The sizing was really weird. They had like two to five months and then six to 12 months. Even looking at it right now, I'm a little nervous. It's a duck. Okay, I'm scared. I'm actually really scared because it today is like the 22nd because he's four months old today. It's the 22nd and he normally wears like six to nine month clothing and I read a whole bunch of reviews and according to the reviews, I needed to get him two to five months. Okay, 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 yes. Okay, all right. I think so. I think yes. I don't think it's yeah, okay. How many times am I gonna say okay? But people were saying that the six to 12 month one looks like it could fit like their two year old toddler. And then people were saying that this one looked like it could fit a one year, some people said it looked like it could fit a one year old and then some people didn't say all that. But <laughs> it's gonna be a duck because Walmart had nothing. We were looking at Walmart and they had like a few girl baby costumes, like little fairies and princesses and stuff. And they had like, they, there was nothing, nothing for babies. So um, yes, I wanna try this on him, but I kinda wanna save him being in it for you guys to see for Halloween. I'll just let you guys know if it fits him. Okay, and he's waking up. He just woke up, so I'm about to dry it on him. I'm so excited. Ah! And I love this. it's gonna be really warm. If it fits him, it's gonna be really warm for Halloween because it's always freezing here on Halloween. Hi, do you want me to try your duck costume on you? Yes, I really hope it fits you. Oh my goodness. Okay, little update, it fits. This is all you get, proof that it fits. I'm saving his face for Halloween. I'm so excited, it's so cute. He has been coughing, he has had a runny nose, teething has been kicking his booty. We took him to the doctor and he's not sick. She said that it might have something to do with us living near fields and stuff. She's had a lot of kids having coughs and runny noses and things like that because of the farming and stuff. But teething has also no. been kicking his butt. Four month sleep regression has been kicking mommy's butt. Yes, but he seems to be in a decent mood today. He has not been himself the past couple of days. No, sir, but I love you so much. Say, I'm just having a hard time. Yes, Miles is just having a hard time. And he's pooping. All right, fantastic. Mommy. Would you like this? Mommy. Yes, Bryce. I know. Do you like your pineapple? I think him likes his pineapple. He's just trying to figure out how to get a hold of it. But once he gets a hold of it, oh, you sound so awful. He chews on it. What? Okay, Ham, I'm gonna run and get your diaper. I'm gonna run. I'm gonna run. And then I'll be right back. I'm gonna change your butt. <gasps> what is that? Nine. Nine. Good job. Nine. You're so smart. Like ten. Ten. It's not focusing on his tablet, but there's a ten right there. He literally knows all his numbers, or at least he knows to ten. And I'm pretty sure he knows all of his it's letters a pizza. now, too. It looks like a pizza tin. Yes. Good job. I love you. Too. <laughs> he just says you too because he's rude.
Okay, so today for lunch, I made a little like fried chicken salad using baby spinach. I'm very, very plain when it comes to my salads, so it's literally just chicken, a little bit of croutons, a little bit of cheese, a little bit of ranch, and a bunch of baby spinach on the bottom. I also wanted to share with you guys, this chicken right here is the best frozen chicken I have tried in a while. I saw another YouTuber talking about it, and she was talking about how it doesn't have any weird fatty pieces in it or anything like that, and I made this exact same salad yesterday using this chicken, and I completely agree. I love this chicken. I'm definitely going to be putting this in my future grocery orders and then also I just wanted to show I used these Olive Garden croutons because they are the best croutons hands down but I know this isn't grilled chicken or anything like that but it's still a lot healthier than what I normally eat for lunch and I didn't put a ton of ranch or a ton of cheese or anything like that on there I do plan on getting some different dressing that might be a little bit lighter or healthier the next time I go grocery shopping but ranch is just the only dressing that I had on hand but anyways that is my lunch Okay, you guys, so we are in the school pickup line to pick up Liam from school. And usually if I get here early enough to where I'm sitting and waiting in line, I will bring a snack with me. This is not gonna shock any of you guys what my snack is because I feel like I talk about these all the time. But usually my main first choice of a snack every day is one of these kind bars. I really like the dark chocolate nuts and sea salt. It's just a perfect salty and sweet snack. I just feel like it's perfect. So that's usually what I gravitate towards. So that's gonna be my snack today and of course water I've been drinking water all day with breakfast and lunch and everything I just failed to mention that also this is what we're gonna be making for dinner it's just a recipe that I found on Pinterest it's just a real easy baked chicken recipe it's honestly very self-explanatory and very simple but I was just trying to look up something simple like that we'll probably have either like broccoli or asparagus with it i'm gonna see what josh is feeling i'm honestly cool with either one of those things for sides so we shall see i will show you guys how it turns out whenever we get home but i'm gonna figure out what these cars are doing i don't understand what they're doing yeah i'll just see you guys when we get home Okay, you guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and end out the video here, but that is what a typical day of eating looks like for me. Please let me know if you want me to continue doing these because I definitely can. Obviously, I don't eat the same exact thing every single day, so I would love to give you guys some ideas. If you guys have any ideas for me, comment them down below. I'm definitely always looking for more ideas, healthy food ideas, but we're gonna wind down for the night. Miles is getting tired and fussy, so I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.